hi everyone you're welcome back to my vivi creations channel so today i want to show you how you can easily add certain trim to your tool that is your net okay so there are other ways of doing this but i just want to show you the easiest way you can do this without giving yourself any headache the easiest way so i have gotten to this stage of the dress i have videos on this channel on how you can make your ball dress okay your ball gown so having gotten to this stage i just want to show you how you can add satin trim so if you're new to this channel i say a very big welcome to you do well to hit on that subscribe button and turn on the notification bell so that you don't miss out on any of my videos. So now, let's get started. Gotten to this level of my dress, which you already know. The body's added belt to it, then gathered my tool, the net, to my flame. So, the tool is what I want to pipe. Now, I made the tool and the the flay to be almost the same length okay so even if they are not the same length the two should be a little bit longer than the the satin flay so now i want to pipe it which is the lesson for today that is to pipe with your satin okay it's also called satin trim so what you do is to cut your satin to be as long as your net you can see the width of the net that is how long your satin should be okay so and you can even cut out more of the satin because the net can be some nets are stretchy so as you're sewing you find out that if you have exactly the same length of net and uh, that is if your, if your satin is exactly the same length that if you cut out exactly the same length by the time you're sewing it on it you might end up not having enough because the material the the net might be stretchy so you just cut out extra like extra five inches and how do you cut it depending on the boldness you want or that is depending on the size you want like me i want three inches so this is three inches so what i did is to cut seven okay i cut out seven inches as i measure seven inches and i cut out so after cutting it out i folded it I folded it on the wrong side as you can see I folded it on the wrong side stitched it by half inch so that I'll have three inches left on fold okay so after stitching it I then turn this to the right side so because it is very very long I had to use this ruler to turn it because it's very long so if you don't have, um, have enough that is if the length of your satin is not long enough you can cut it as in you you can cut and join like i did here you can cut and join but the ideal thing is to get the same length for example if your tool is five yards you get five yards of satin and you cut it along that five yards okay so it be long as five yards so that's what i'm trying to say so after folding it and stitching then I turned to the right side and this is what I have okay so with this now I will sew it on the net so I'll just sew it at the edge of the net and also when I'm sewing I'll just sew close to the edge of the satin okay so I just I have done everything I need to do that is just joined everything so now I will just sew this to the net alone okay so this part where i stitched that is where i'll place on the net like this and sew it okay all to the end of the net so i'll have it there so i'll do just that and you see what it looks like okay so after sewing it this is what i have so you can see it okay so you see why i said the the net and the flesh should be the same height so that you complete the length of the two with the the satin trim so this is it so by the time you sew it the this one the satin that is the flay 
will just be at this edge and the trim will be there okay then you can actually make it longer if you want if you want it that the lace that the net to be longer than the satin like let it be showing like this you can do it so it depends on your choice and you can also have this in layers okay so you can have about two to three layers of it but this is just simply how to make it how to pipe your tool or how to add satin trim to your tool so i'll go ahead and finish up the dress and you see the final outlook so this is it though i haven't added hard net on that so it's not looking full yet by the time i do that the beauty of the dress will come out so thank you for watching see you in my next video bye